So we have Zach um, in for a board and train. We have the new raw complete. You look at the integrity of this food. So you can feed it direct. You can use it to train. We make little uh, meatballs. It's about engagement. Is the dog going to be engaged with the reward? Is it high value enough? Let's see. Let's go. <laughs> look at the focus. Good. There we go. Yes. There we go. Good. Now, you're going to take him offline. Good. And we're going to just show the level of engagement that we have with this beauty. What a beauty. Load up a couple. Let's go. STS canine. Huh? Good. Good. Wonderful. Spin him round. Yeah. Good show. Uh, Good lad. Way. Yeah. Good lad. Good. Wonderful. That's it. Wonderful. Good lad. That's it. If the reward Good. is of high enough value, yeah. the canine will absolutely love to work for you. This is a typical uh, role from a dog food company. Typical Can I put it in there? Yeah. Oh, typical roll. Yeah. And this is what we're giving you. Make your mind up. That's just byproducts from an abattoir. So you've just zeroed that out, right? Cheap has never been cheerful. We will vacuum seal in good quality containers the food the moment we finished uh, preparing so that you don't have product that just leaks all over the place uh, when you're defrosting it in your homes. We have all the meat that's been done and if we come over here um, we're now looking at the ratio of um, fruits, um, vegetables, um, we have the um, sweet potato. This is a wonderful carb. Um, a lot of dogs have a uh, sort of intolerance to certain, um, you know, carbohydrates. I believe that this carbohydrate is a fantastic carbohydrate for, 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 for dogs. It's uh, very delicious as well. You look at the, the mix that we have at the moment, and all of this has gone straight in. Yeah. And that, we want to mix now. Mix profile at the moment, we're going to run for a, a three minute mix. Perfect blend. I like the chunkiness of this. Proteins. Chicken is something that I'm noticing a lot of dogs seem to have allergies with. Uh, coincidentally, I think poultry is probably one of the most corrupt protein sources that you can get in this country. Um, the growth uh, profile, the breed profile, the housing concerns, and the antibiotics, and even the integrity of the feed. What we're using is grass-fed whole lambs. This is just pure grass-fed organic lamb. That's what's going into the meal preps. So we have a young Chinese red dog. Um, and what we're trying to show you is the raw feed, um, how we can use that directly as treats. Okay, so. That's it. Okay. So you probably want to put that slightly out of the way yeah. and load up a couple into your hands. You can see the desire for the product. Drop the line, keep him engaged. And what we want to see when we look at the desirability for the product, at the moment, take the line off. Oh, and what we get completely off. And what we just want to see when we talk about the commitment to the, to the product, shut your arm, shut your hand off, okay? And we want to just see how focus this young dog is then give him a little bit
quick pace, walk away. Quick pace, quick pace, quick pace, quick pace. Stop and give him some. Take off again. Spin round. Give him some. Good. Yeah. Good. A good product. You need to have incredible desire. Isn't that remarkable? So, got the raw. Let's look at that. He's going crazy for it, right? He needs to work. We're going to take him up on that platform there. Up on this one? Yeah. How much does he love it? How much does he love it? Don't help him. He needs to figure it out. <laughs> Anything for all. Bring him back and then let him win it up on top of here. Good lad. Put it down.